Thank you so much, Graham. Right now, onto something rather unique. Now, every mom wants to be the best for her new baby, and that often begins with the nutrition of breast milk. However, not every baby is born on time, and some arrive early, leading to a tough situation where baby needs breast milk, but mom just can't be there to provide it. Thankfully, an incredible initiative in Cape Town is already at work with a very awesome solution. Now we know that mother's milk is absolutely crucial to newborn babies as it contains all the essential nutrients and vitamins to support the healthy growing of babies and also to build a very strong immune system. The reality is however that many mothers aren't able to provide milk for their newborn babies but one brilliant organization has responded to that call and seeks to change all of it. It's called Mom's Milk on the Move. One in seven babies are born premature and their mothers are often discharged from hospital with cost and distance, preventing moms from getting milk to their preemie babies. This project solves this dilemma with a scooter delivery system. I used to deliver medication to patients within my community and I, I just started having that passion for actually working with, with the community and people and then the opportunity of the Moms Project came along and then, wow, it's just been something that I've always wanted to do. So, yeah, doing the MOM is just extraordinary. Moms Milk on the Move was launched in November of 2007 and is a collaboration between the Grotteskeer Hospital's Newborn Trust, Scully Scooters, Relate Trust and Consul Glass who are getting scooters on the road to ensure a safe breast milk supply that will help premature babies grow and survive. Neil, Mom's Milk on the Move, I think it's a brilliant initiative. What exactly is the aim of this project? And also, why is it so important for premature babies to have access to Mom's Milk? As we know in South Africa, transport is a massive, massive cost for all of us. Mm. And for the mom to actually get to the hospital every single day became a problem. So we looked, for an, we looked for an opportunity and we got hold of a company called Scully Scooters who does motorbike and scooters training. And we looked for individuals who could actually start their own little businesses, so become entrepreneurs, as well as actually deliver this much needed asset called Mom's Milk every day to the moms in hospital to feed their babies. Now these premature babies at the Grotteskeer Hospital are so vulnerable and in dire need of breast milk. And since the inception of Mom's Milk on the Move not that long ago, already three moms are fully dependent on the project. The project hopes to increase survival rates among premature babies by getting their mom's milk to them, providing the necessary nutrients to build their immune system. However, in cases where mom cannot provide milk, they also pick up and deliver breast milk from donor moms. Victoria, you're a donor for the Mom's Milk Project. What is it about this initiative that first got you excited and wanted to get involved? I started becoming a donor because I had so much milk. And then, because my baby was so small, he couldn't at, at that time um, drink so much milk. So then the nurses started asking me, why don't you become a donor? At first I was very really reluctant and I said, I don't know, I'll think about it, I don't know. And then they were like, no man, because I was like, um, my baby, what about him? They're like, no, your baby will make sure he has um, milk first and then for the other babies, then um, we'll provide the other babies. And then that's where I decided, okay, now I'll become a donor. So you are basically the unsung hero to not only your child, but to so many out there as well. Would you go out and encourage other mums as well that's maybe in a similar situation like yourself, who's got a lot of milk, to become part of the Mom's Milk Project? Definitely, especially if they have enough milk on the breast, especially if they do have enough milk, why not? Because you'll be helping another child there as well. And as I've noticed, ever since being in hospital, there's so, so much premature babies. I never knew about it, but until I gave birth premature, now I see there's so much, so, so much premature babies that need the milk, actually. And moms are struggling, some moms are struggling giving, um, expressing milk for the babies. They really do want to, but they can't. So that's we come, that's, that, that is where we come in to help them with milk, if we can. Just to see those babies in those in incubators makes me feel that it's worthwhile doing what I'm doing and I can even do more, you know, and just by saving one life, you know, it's, it's just an amazing. 
As a dad, I know how important it is for newborns and premature babies to get the right nutrition. And Mom's Milk on the Move is making sure that they answer that call for so many women and babies in dire need. And I wish them nothing but the best with this project because it is simply amazing what they are doing.